Man, I am so impressed. What's going on everybody? I'm Mecca coming at you and it is a gray and dreary today here in Mission BC. Um, if you are brand new to the channel, my name is Mecca. This is Driven Hard and I got a special video today. Heading over to Mission to the gas station and uh, I'm meeting up a, with a buddy and uh, we are going to go head to head with the Driven Hard Range Rover with something that really it has absolutely no business competing with. These two vehicles do not go hand in hand. They do not get cross shopped. And um, honestly, I couldn't even find a lot of videos on YouTube with these two vehicles hitting trails together. So you guys are in for a treat. Let me know what you think in the comments, but uh, I, I'm gonna be pulling up to the gas station really quick here. There he is. This is gonna be an interesting video. You see him? What am I getting myself into with that? <laughs> How you doing, man? I'm good, I'm good. Set. Hopefully you weren't waiting too, too long. No, no, we're good, man. All right, guys, we're here at the trailhead. I got my boy, you want to introduce yourself? I'm Justin. Justin, and check out this beast, huh? So, you want to tell us about the Jeep? So it's a 2019 JL Rubicon. Uh, so that means it is meant to go four by four in. So yeah, this, so, uh, so you got a four inch lift? Four inch lift, box, 38 inch tires. It has rear and front lockers, sway bar disconnect for crawling. So it's a full Rubicon. It's ready to go. Oh, yeah. I love that color, man. And have you hit lots of trails with it already? Or? Of course, yeah. of course. <laughs> you can't not have it, not go um, yeah, lots of people have Jeeps and don't go 4x4 four four in here. So you don't have, so is the red dash an option? Or they give you a choice of colors? Or is that... I want it black. You, you want can, it You black. can get it. Uh, okay. But I, yeah, it was black on... And then just red okay. stitching tape, I do. Right. Yeah, they've... Oh my god, and look, that's the best part right there. <laughs> the manual. Right? Oh, that's wicked, man. So. Yeah. All right. I think it's gonna be a little bit better than uh, your go-to vehicle here. Uh, yeah. So this is gonna be exciting. Um, look at the tire difference, right? Like, my God. This is, I even put in an off-road height just so it looks a little, just to bump it up a little bit, right? <laughs> Give me a few more inches. But uh, no, this is gonna be cool. Um, you know, obviously we got the Range Rover, the, the, the quote-unquote, it's gonna be really fun. The quote unquote city dweller, <laughs> right? Because l let's be honest. Here we um, get the two friends on on that don't want to be on video. They, they don't They're not be on social. So They're not social. Those people. guys aren't as social okay. as we are. So let's be honest. Um, not a lot of people go off road in It's it's definitely it's definitely a little bit more unique, right? <laughs> a little bit, a little bit. We are here to see. Um, now, like, let's be honest, you will kill me on pretty much any trail, guarantee. Those tires, that ground clearance, <laughs> your approach to park triangles, I'm not even going to pretend I could compete with you with the serious stuff. But what we do want to see today is how can I keep up with you yep. without doing damage? <laughs> okay, without hey, doing that's damage. That's on you, you're the driver. <laughs> yeah. you're the driver. Spotters. We got spotters. Yeah. You're the driver, so. So we, we just want to see, have some fun and see, because like obviously nobody's cross shopping these two vehicles. They're like you don't really see the the, the Range Rover and uh, a lifted Wrangler out like not together. To, not together. Not together. No. So it's it's kind of a cool video just to kind of compare and contrast two polar opposites. We have like the Wrangler DNA, dinosaur. It's mechanical. It's proven. It's yeah. it's tested. Um, that thing we just you can pick up a hammer and a rock and fix it. <laughs> then we have the sophisticated, like city dwelling, city you know. dwelling, you know, overly complicated, sometimes unnecessarily complicated <laughs> <laughs> Range Rover. But it has off-roading DNA in its history. Is it a little bit more city focused? No, I don't know. But Range Rover, Land Rover, they've been... They've been there? They, they've been offered... In fact, Land Rover built the Defender... The Defender. After that, yep. Yeah, yeah, based on the Wrangler My because... My friend Nick over there thought you had a Defender when he's like, Oh, we're going we're going 4 by 4 with the with a Land Rover or Range Rover. He's like, Oh, it's a Defender, sweet! I was like, Sorry to disappoint quite. you, Nick. 
<laughs> so, um, but uh, yeah, so it's gonna be fun. Um, I got my winter tires on, but the air pressure is way too high, so I'm gonna actually do some of that right now. And uh, we're gonna go, that's the trailhead. I've actually come to the spot. And Have you gone down to Davis Lake before? No, no, okay. no, no. This is actually the first time I've, I've gone four, four by fouring with somebody else. Oh, perfect. Usually I'm just by myself. So like I know my limits and you know, I'm pretty good with, with that um, aspect. So it'll be cool to be able to kind of I don't see any, not worry about getting stuck. There's no I, reason. I don't think you'll get any damage, but obviously there is some tight stuff. You're going to have to totally. use your own discretion. Right? And it is, it's going to be a little slick. So little it's, slick, yeah. it's sliding off stuff. And you do have to, okay, good. I yeah, yeah. so I, 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 I took off, I took off the, um, the front cover to, to that. And then in the back, I put this ridiculous thing on, but yeah, yeah. So like, I can prepare to uh, to tow your ass out when oh, you yeah. get stuck. Well, it's okay. I got, <laughs> I'm I'm prepared to cut trees down. I what got, do you got here? We got tools to fix, and I got all tow tow shackles and stuff. Awesome. So, all right, good stuff. We're ready to go. All right, guys. Hey, if you're ready to have some fun, leave me a comment. Hit like. Let's do this. So, so far, it's been good. Uh, just, you know, some, some water crossing and uh, yeah, you know, it's coming along. Nothing too insane. How are you guys enjoying the video so far? Give me a like, give me a comment. That looks exciting. Definitely we need something a little bit more technical, a little bit more slippery, because right now it's pretty dead even. Um, nothing's really been fully tested. And we came out here to drive hard, so I'm not gonna let you guys down, don't worry. In case you're wondering, we're still in auto low range, obviously. We've got a beautiful lake. And uh, he promises we got some more technical stuff coming up here, guys. So, uh, should, should be exciting. Oh boy. 
<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Mm. Okay. a little cold but oh man i hope you guys enjoy this video
getting that? Bit of a rock there, yeah, I'm getting that. All right. Actually, we're gonna... You can see that. Yeah, I see that big one. So I, am I going in here? Well, he, I think he went over it, but try to go around. It's probably, it looks, it looks good. That's a big ass rock. That's for sure. Yeah, it looks clear. Good. Yeah. Man, I am so I'm, impressed. I'm, I'm impressed. You want to see this cool feature? Let me show you the, the weight sensor. This is a sick video, <laughs> okay? So, am I, if I, what's in front of me? I don't know, I, it doesn't, like to me, from here, there's this rock here, which you can see. There's another one, I don't know, 
three feet in so front of it. So what's over then, there? But nothing. It looks, I don't know why you So I can go that way more? I would, yeah. You like it? Uh, yeah, you would have to do Can't turn the phone, otherwise it looks all funky. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Super. Okay. So, we're coming up on something we don't know. In the middle of the river. I refuse to lose to that thing. <laughs> So we wanted to find out if the Range Rover could keep up with the Rubicon. Now before all you fucking Jeepers get out there, oh that wasn't off ready. You know how you guys get, right? <laughs> um, okay, well I want to hear from, uh, from a Jeep owner's perspective, okay? What, 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 what did you think of, uh, you know? I mean, that wasn't full crazy wheeling but <laughs> there we go uh he followed me got here everywhere that i did so you know what we'll see we'll go we'll go a little harder next time and we'll see what happens yeah like i'd like so, like a little bit more technical climbing okay um you know some off camber stuff we can do that you know yeah. within you know there's lots of things maybe, maybe less water <laughs> <laughs> no water is good <laughs> right but uh yeah Honestly, super impressed. Super impressed. Wow. Same here, man. Right? I can't believe it. You thought what I, I was? You thought I was crazy going through the water. I did. I did. <laughs> right? I, I, I was actually when you pulled up, I said, "What the?" <laughs> <is this?" laughs> PG-14 rating. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> There's the little horn for all the swear words. So it's all good. But uh, we made it. It's absolutely gorgeous here. But like, I've said it on other videos. I do think. Your ride would be a lot more comfortable on the four service roads. Yeah, well, he's right? he's even said like in this in the Jeep itself, it's like I don't have any issues. In your thing, there was like we might not make it out of here alive. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, because there's you know especially like. But your gadgets yeah. are pretty cool. Seeing right? how deep the water is and stuff, that's pretty interesting. Uh, getting through water is better than seeing how deep the water is. <laughs> okay, so like, weight sensing, it's it's cool. But, and like showing all what all the diffs are doing, yeah, yeah, yeah. shit's cool. I don't care about that. I want to make sure it's <laughs> going. The other side. Right? Yeah, yeah. Like, that's really what you want. Yeah, yeah. But, um... Like, uh, I would be interested to see if with different tires, you know, the experience. Some actual all-terrain. Yeah, so many people yeah. comment on that. It's like, you get you know, 20s and altering tires, it, it, it's like night and day. And I, yeah. I could only imagine, because yeah, the tires, like, especially when it's wet, like I was coming up that snowbank and I was like, oh, it's gonna be a little sketchy. But yeah. like, once again, it didn't slip. It just crawled its way up. So yeah. the tech does surprise me even, oh, yeah. but uh, no, but yeah. So guys, we're gonna wrap it up here. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel for more crazy content. We gotta do this again. We will do this again. We will do this again. And uh, until next time, everyone, drive hard. Yeah.